if I didn't get the acknowledge, what uh, what will do is I will uh, send the data again. So my data will be lost. See, I'm transmitting it to the uh, 1024 bytes of data huh? in a, a certain amount of time. So again, I'm transmitting the data if not uh, acknowledgement is not received. So I will lose that uh, bandwidth. That's okay. right. In order to reduce that, I will only send a ping to know that if the device is still there. Well, well. So, my, uh, so it's a kind of a saved. confirmation uh, thing. Yeah. Okay. And uh, next comes start the start of frame. Start of frame, frame yes. Okay, start of frame means I'll be, uh, I already told you that uh, my data will be in frames, form of frames. I'll be having micro frames, all those things, super frames, micro frames. Okay. So uh, in each frame, it will there will be having a number. So uh, first for my first mi micro frame, I'll have a number. I'll assign it set uh, it as one for sending. And for next, I'll uh, give the number two, three, like that. Exactly, okay. and then uh, the frame number would be taking here in this case uh, the 11 bits, and the then we have a CRC associated with each one of them. Yeah. So it's important to see, and also the PID is uh, what is existing in all of these: the start of frame, then the handshake, the data, and also the token. So it is one of the important fields. Now the USB transactions. Yeah. So how these transactions are happening, let's have a quick look of how it is. The token packet, the data packet, and then the handshake packet. So this is a kind of a three-stage transfer, mm -hmm. where the first stage is the token, the second is the data, which would be transmitted, and next would be the handshake packet. Mm -hmm. So in all in all, this full uh, three-stage transfer would be a one transaction. And in this case, when we talk about the two-stage transfer, it is a token packet and then the data packet, mm -hmm. and the handshake is not included here. Yeah. So this is another uh, particular uh, transaction. And in this case, a one-stage transfer would be the token packet, mm -hmm. and this uh, is again another transaction. Yeah. Okay. Uh. So in particular, uh, we are dealing uh, with the, these transactions here as seen for each of the transfers, three, two, and one stage transfer. And uh, exactly our full transaction would be of uh, these three stages. Mm -hmm. Now the PID field format and a type in case of the full speed and the low speed. So how is it? We can see here the PID type, the PID name, and then uh, the description. So PID would be included in each of them, as we've already seen in the earlier slides. It's associated with the token, data, handshake, as uh, seen here. We see uh, the token is here, PID, the data, PID. So it's all associated uh, with all of these.